It's Friday, so it's time for Movie Reviews, a documentary about rescuing and treating birds in India, and the third sequel in a highly popular sports drama series, Linda Cook, is here to review those two films with us. Hey, Linda, how you doing? I'm good. You know, uh, I was listening to the forecast earlier. I'm uh -huh. not sure whether your guess was right or not, but that's the one I would have guessed, too. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I do know there's no guessing about snow. Oh, so no it, it seems it's going to happen, right? So here's a, a movie that you can see in the comfort of your living room or another one you can see in the comfort of a theater. All right, let's get into it. The first one is uh, All That Breathes, right? Yes. All That Breathes is a documentary that um, was nominated for Best Documentary. It didn't make it, but it earned an Oscar nod. And the idea of this movie is that see the you can see the birds flying here those are kites hmm. and kites are a kind of predator that um, the thing that we fly for a toy and for a hobby is named after they have a, a real interesting way of soaring and flying they're quite beautiful in the air these two brothers in this documentary have been saving kites that are native to their delhi um, india named to their where they live and pollution and various things bring some of these birds down and these brothers go to great lengths to maintain the population of these birds that are so important to the ecosystem there. I love this movie. It is so passionate. It is so heartfelt. And these brothers are so, they're just mm. so kind and good. And of course they have their squabbles as siblings. The idea is more than this. Um, there is unrest outside the sanctuary that is human unrest as well. Mm -hmm. So we get a look at, uh, at a sometimes harsh environment and a some, sometimes forgiving environment where everyone can breathe. I gave it four out of four stars. It is beautiful. It is on HBO Max. Mm, I got to watch that, that documentary. How about Creed 3? Oh, <laughs> this movie. I love this movie so much. Um, Michael B. Jordan goes behind the camera and in front of the camera, which shows what a remarkable talent he is. He takes his character, Creed, to the next level now. Uh, he's retired. He's a devoted father and husband, and everything is going just great until a person from his past emerges, uh, arrives at the gym, and says, don't you owe me something? So this threat becomes a little more intense as each scene goes by. Um, and the idea is that he wants, his former childhood friend, wants the same chance to mm. be a boxer that Creed had. Um, the movie is just beautiful to look at. Um, Very much so, Michael I'm B, looking Michael at it right B's, now. How many oh, stars would you give well, this movie, Linda? It is so, so good. And you don't have to see the other two to enjoy it, although that would help. And of course, I've seen the entire Rocky franchise. I love the way this is going, but Jordan's direction is just amazing. And of course, his performances too. I'm gonna call this on an early Oscar nod. I know it's early in the year, but I think this movie will be mentioned come Oscar time next year. I Sounds gave this two, four out of four stars. Four out I of four. love this film. Both of these movies are fantastic. Um, this one, you have to go out to the theater to see. Thank you so much, Linda. It's good to see you as well. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Well, you can see Linda's full reviews at rquadcities.com.